Welcome in once again to the YGO Fresh Off The Press community, where we analyze the current polls, trends, and forecast of the Yu-Gi-Oh! market. So we're here to feed the endless eternal Yu-Gi-Oh! cardboard market watch addiction, guys. You guys already know. Welcome in, man. We're always smiling. We're always feeling good. Good vibes, good energy. If you appreciate that, destroy that subscribe button, guys. I really appreciate it. Ring that bell. We're trying to grow, we're trying to scale. We're already at 4.1K. Thank you so much to all of you guys. Then 4.5 and then a 5K giveaway. I'm thinking about a product, maybe a box or something like that, you know, to mix it up. I don't think we've ever given a, a box as a giveaway. Um, so we might do that at 5K. So make sure you ring that bell. You subscribe if you want to participate in our channel giveaways. Don't forget, guys, there's a thumbnail template contest. If there's any of you guys skilled artists out there, don't forget, there's a 25 Billy TCG. No, not TCG. Visa gift card available, plus extra goodies as well for the winners or for those selected. Um, So come over here in the Discord, man. Join the movement. Don't miss out. It, you know, hey, it's up there for grabs. Um, you know, so by March 13th, we got like a week left. Make sure you don't miss out. I want to shout out to Richard, Richard Bureau, man, a member of the channel for many, many months now, always provided value to me, you know, just commenting, um, letting me know, uh, uh, you know, supporting me and the channel and everything. And I appreciate it. Shout out to Richard. He deserves this as a member of the channel. And listen, Jay, I'm here to tell you that that day you featured Albion three months ago was the day I bought mine for $9.80, sir. You say that when they forget, we remember. Let's go. And I want you to know how true that is today. I'm sitting on a huge come up. And sure, I was going to buy Albion anyway for my branded uh, branded deck, but uh, branded build, I guess. But I bought it that day because you said, let this one, like, don't let this one pass by. You're the man. This channel is the real deal. You're always going to have a supporting member in me. Let's go, Richard. Let's go. That's my guy, Richard. By the way, you want to be like Richard and you want to join the movement. One click gets you in to get all that value. I need to make a members video. Shout out to the members. My bad. It's, it's been crazy, you know, um, these past couple of days and weeks. So I apologize for that. I need to get a members video um, out for you guys. So stay tuned for that. But in the meantime, Whoa, 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 Richard, my guy. Thank you so much. Wanted to shout you out. I'm glad. Um, and what let, let, let me see. Let me see. What's Albion doing right now? Look at it. Albion. I think I was gonna I'm gonna talk about this card um in tomorrow's market watch. But uh yeah, look at it. Man. Mm -mm -mm. Look at that spike, man. Richard is eating good. He said he bought a single digis. My guy bought a single digis. And he's up the BX, man must be nice i'm glad we talked about this as single digits guys you heard it there the proof is in the pudding my guy richard highlighting this a couple of days ago um and i really appreciate it um so yeah yeah i'm just glad to continue to provide value guys we're having a whatnot stream on friday that's the goal around 8 30 p.m eastern time that's the goal for now my i want to stream after that on youtube as well so friday is that day that now i'm targeting to do it all to go live sometimes on whatnot but definitely on youtube so Friday, the, this stream would come first, and then the YouTube one after that. We always provide great deals on over there. You guys know, the OGs know, the people that swing by. We provide amazing cards at amazing prices, $1 starters. Um, so make sure you swing by. Jay, that's all good and well, but talk to me about the meta. The meta game report number eight. Guys, over there in the OCG, we have a new contender. Ten Pie Dragons here, guys. Fire King still dominant over there in the ocg that's pretty impressive pretty impressive you have pure snake eye here as a solid third and then voices voice as a solid fourth then branded and ritual beast with the new support mm, interesting because i think over there we're getting support in legacy of destruction if i'm not mistaken so uh all right that's pretty cool top five ran right there one two three four five with branded and then the honorable mention ritual beast but tenpai dragons i mean i like it i like it your boy likes it honestly I like the artwork. Now, I haven't played it. I need to play it, man, on the app. I haven't used this EDO Pro in forever. Um, I need to get on that because I like I like the potential. I like dragons. I like the artwork. So who knows, man? Maybe this brings me back. But I mean, that's the thing, man. Probably mad expense. You know, ridiculous prices paid away, man. Should we go down that road? Man, hopefully you guys are having fun with it. But yeah, over there, Fire Kings continue to dominate the meta. Um, over there in the OCG and Tenpai Dragons. We're gonna discuss that, you know, today with this 
um, right here. We're just going to discuss again. Don't take this, um, uh, you know, uh, to the bank in the sense, oh, this is going to be the end all be all list and everyone's going to be running exactly these cards and things of that nature. No, that's not the point. We want to have an idea. That's the whole point. We have an idea of what's coming, what cards will be played. Check the prices on some of these to see if we pick these up now, sooner rather than later. When no one else, yeah, Tenpai Dragons is coming. That's later on in the summer. You know, no one really cares about that. That's far away. No, we care. We care early. That's why you're here, because we provide this value, because we allow you guys to be early to the game. We don't want to be the masses. We don't want to come in late and paying premiums. We don't do that. We get in early. We buy in cheap. We get access to the cards we live. We need so we can live to fight another day. So we have Ogre here. You see Triple ghost ogre guys remember this card is getting reprinted in the seven um different into seven different rarities in the 25th rarity collection too to my knowledge if i'm not mistaken i think so right my brain works sometimes and sometimes it doesn't but guys um keep that in mind but still i'm gonna be watching these ot's like a hawk that's just me everything else i don't care about i just don't care about this card yeah prismatic looks beautiful out of billions some change we're gonna have qcsrs and pcrs and all that good stuff so me, I'm going to be looking at this card like a hawk. Your boy said this card was going to go under triple digits. And here we are. Here we are right now. We clean this up janitor style. This card is $83 right now. Your boy is looking at 50s. Jay is looking at this card to be at $50. Is it possible? Yes. Is it probable? I mean, who knows? That is a stretch, but I'm excited. Once that rarity collection two comes out, if this hits 50 bills, your boy's in. Your boy's in. $150 for a play set of Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit. That's me right there. That's just me. Why? Because it's beautiful. Ghost Ogre OT? Man, don't don't, don't be that guy. Like, uh, Jay, uh, you know, QCSR Ogre is max red. Man, get out of here. I mean, look at this. Look at this OT. Just clean cut, fresh off the press, just like the channel. Right now, falling knife mode, dumping down. Just like we said, guys. We told you guys it was 100 and some things. We said, guys, this is going to be double digits. Here we are. Three pages only. I mean, you see the, the, the RL6s and the RL3s, uh, 30 listings. I like it. I like it. So, but again, again, you know, it is played um, most likely here in this deck. This deck is full of hand traps. Look at that. Of course, they have M Maxi over there, but triple ass, triple ogres, triple bells, and triple veilers. That's insane. And even two phantasmes with the third one um, in the side and double shifters and double spooky dog was and double nibs. Man, that's crazy. This is hand trap city and trap deck right here um obviously starting off with ogre um just have your copies right now i think i have a play set of just prismatics just have access to the card once it comes out in the rarity collection to or rarity bump probably to the p uh platinum secret rares um at the bare minimum while we attempt to get the ot's down the line then we have effect veiler again we said it was hand trap city the first part of this market watch is just reviewing um those hand traps that people might need to play tenpai dragons once they come out guys effect veiler is readily available here with a bunch of prints but don't take these prices for granted oh jay hand traps are getting reprinted left and right uh, most of them came in the rarity collection one and then the rest are coming in rarity collection two those are facts but also don't, they all come in one box in one product okay so it'll always be behind that one paywall yeah we have seven different rarities including supers and ultras easy to get but at the end of the day once that product dries up that's it they're all hard to get including the supers including the ultras you know for the most part um so i think these will age well i would come in just get your veilers look at this just a clean super rare out of billy where's the ultra where's the ultra where is it man where is it you guys are right here look at that out of billy clean ultra rare veiler just get access to these hand traps don't let them become officially billies and abilities in some change you know from a billy to a billy 25 that's 25 percent increase you don't want to do that you don't want to be that guy paying even that little premium you want to get in early get in cheap get your veilers you know if you want to invest in r09 do it too you know that's just my humble opinion i've been just buying cards from the rarity collection and anytime i order a couple of cards you know i make some things happen i slide these in there i have a triple effect veilers of psrs for my personal uh, play set but also i have a, a play set of a secrets just regular secrets here as an investment wow this card looks beautiful come in just get your veilers if you prefer pur's or pcr's this dualist saga one wow man look at that it's already starting to move on up 
because people need veilers for tangled plant people are going to need veilers for tenpai dragons people are using veilers right now it's just a great card i can't believe this is up to three dollars again and then quickly a lot of one-ups i mean hard is beautiful it just is it's hard to get look at that 12 listings only the man is coming in um guys get on the train before it leaves you don't want to be that guy that misses the opportunity to hop on the train guys we're getting a reprint of this as well in the rarity collection too so right now four prints and uh, we expect seven additional prints for this card so i wouldn't be touching this car uh this card or any of these cards with a 10 foot pull honestly right now um i don't think i have any of these left if i do shame on me why because we're getting seven different prints even the secret rares still unlimbs at 13s get out of here man if you have this card just unload this man no way 14 dollars with the wall of china nah, at first that's what 15s that's a dump man right now you can get 45 dollars or 40 to 45s um for a place it a phantasm no way that's don't leave that value on the table we recycle our purchasing power you don't want to see this card become single digits and then under fives once we get all those secret rare reprint uh, all those seven different rarities including another secret rare don't be that guy but again it's used here at twos in the main deck one in the side again you can't take this deck it did go seven and one so that's good but some people are gonna main three some people are gonna side three out so at the end of the day you just need access to the card to make those decisions now forbidden drop it's a card that we've been talking non-stop on the channel don't take these prices for granted today yeah they're two dollars three five sixes yeah all of these could be double digits down the line they can you can get a, a something like super polys where all versions were you know two dollars here and there even the commons and now they're pushing like 750s all around and and most of them even in the double digi range this could be that card forbidden droplet just broken here we can sue we can see two of them right there in the main so you want to make sure that you guys um get exposure to it sooner rather than later come on now that's what you want that's what you want you want to make sure you get these cards cheap for a billy two billies that's good good to get cards like forbidden drop with this cheap look at this just clean secret rare 250s to threes you're telling me with ten dollars you can even get a, a platinum secret rare play set nah man get out of here this is cheap man cheap any stonkish card here as an investment just beautiful get your droplets if you're playing tenpai you're gonna want your two to threes you know and again some people are gonna be running different cards here in the tcg we get it this is not the end all be all list you know maybe it's gonna be way different here in the tcg that's fine but the core of it hand traps like you know it's gonna run hand traps and like imperms and like these regular hand traps as well oh there's the one nib i didn't even realize it yo this dude made like hand traps insane um amount of hand traps inside that deck but again forbidden droplets 30 dollars for qcsrs that's cheap this is gonna be 50 bills before you know it and the 75 to 85 so the ot's are good as well so great time to get exposure to any version of this card right now in my humble opinion then we have magnum magnum we saw one right here abyssal magnum not bad so right now no one's looking at this card no one cares about this card it's already got hit it already got hit to one on the list everyone that wants the card already has their copy a lot of consolidation sideways here near the all-time lows at ability 27 don't forget about this card don't forget about magnum the potential is there at least as a one of right there you want exposure to a card like this from the tins getting harder to get beautiful uh, uh prismatic secret max rarity at a billion some change just get put five dollars into this guys and, and grab you know a place at three to four copies come on now just get that exposure that's really really cheap this could be a two to two dollar two two dollars and fifty cent card um down the line so you can take advantage of the two of that 2x easy especially if the demand comes in with this deck then we have infinite impermanence guys a card that we've been non-stop talking uh, about this card um with you guys on the channel i said guys just pick up what you need i told you guys literally in one of our penny stock videos about the 25th rarity i told you guys don't sleep on imprint yeah it's cheap now it has a bunch of supers and multiple ultras and it has this and that you you want to get that exposure now you, you know even commons are pushing fours that means that the man is going crazy for this card don't take these deals for granted that's the whole point of today's video right here that's it right there look at that even the qcsr is getting cleaned out what 67s moving into the triple 
digis range right now insane nine listings only single digit listings pushing 120s insanity what is going on right now with this card look at that clean this up janitor style mm -mm -mm. you have an 11 wall 120s and then 150s at the bottom of the page only one page of that look people coming in let's see let's see paying triple digits already for this card and uh you know some people consider it max rate no way no way no way why like you're telling me y'all prefer to pay a hundred dollars and then 115s eventually to 120s and stuff nah man instead of paying 125s essentially 130s for this stop it stop i'll pay the extra 15 to 20 dollar bill for ot imperm come on now this is ot but i mean that's good it gives me more time to try and get this card you know what i mean if people got qcsr got people thinking that's max rarity over ot man og ot man nah, nah, don't do that guys nah, come on now come on now what do you guys think qcsr or og ot's let me know let me know let me know what you guys think man no way get your imperms guys just get them too many cheap imperms out there two to three dollars a pop ten dollars gets you a place to get it now don't be that guy paying 15 to 20s minimum for a place at down the line we have spooky um ghost sister and spooky dogwood as well as we showed here with the two ofs right there um and uh yeah it's a card again it has a lost start at around six and every other version is cheap are we getting this one i think we are in the rarity collection too this secret rare i mean it's cheap uh, but it is moving on up let me see here clean this up real quick we see here about nine dollars there's a couple of deals of unlimbs at single digits but after that first that's pushes 13s to 14s 48 listings so you know the demand is coming in people are using it in the meta right now and people are also looking ahead as well once the, this deck comes out we have pot of prosperity let me see where's the pot why did i put it here why uh, man right there the one of right there i don't know is pot at one over there is it at one i mean i think this orange thing does it mean that it's at one yeah i think right magnum and terraform yeah so it's at one in the ocg oh it's at two yeah yeah these are at two these are at ones okay okay so yeah i mean here it's still at three might get hit on the list everyone's speculating stay tuned for tomorrow we're going to do um a ban list speculation prediction video a little bit nothing too big um but yeah yeah people are expecting this card to maybe get hit on the list as you can see on the ocg is hit at the time it's not a card that is being heavily used in the current meta with the best deck um but at the same time there's always rogue decks i'm um, trying to get a crack at that top position you know that uh, uh fire kings and snake eyes and all that diabell star has right now so hey right now seven billies for platinum secrets good single digits for pcrs good even the og secrets all in still in the single digi range you even have five to six dollars og prismatic secrets you got purs around five to sixes regular secrets under sixes supers i would just go this ultra that's insane that, 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 that's too much man that's too much man look at that you have a couple of deals at threes it does eventually it's a lot of one-ups go to five so again if you can squeeze these in in any orders make sure you do so pot of prosperity you can get it anywhere sub five billies or a fives fives and some change is the deal most likely this card is going to double up from here for all versions they'll probably be double digits you want to be early if this card does not get hit on the ban list you know then we expect uh, this card to be at least ten dollars a pop across the board for all versions you want to speculate you want to be early of course if it gets hit on the list then it'll go down in price that's the thing no one's going to know for sure but I'm speculating on this card. Not too much. I'm not getting all nines. I'm not all over the place, but I'm having a couple of, you know, I throw these in and, and when I make an order, whatever, just to have a couple. And then if it doesn't, you know, I don't think it's going to get straight up back, you know, so we'll move it, you know, down the line. That's a risk that I'm willing to take for such a great card. Because even at one, there's going to still be certain demand then. You know what I mean? People are, are going to need the card. Um, of course, most people are going to have play sets. The supply will come in. But after that, it'll certainly still have its demand cosmic cyclone we've been mentioning about uh, we've been mentioning this card about the current meta discussing the current meta right now people are, are citing these at bare minimum citing having them in their side like some people main in this card it's just too good and it's still going to be good look people citing triple cause uh, cosmic cyclones here that's a play set guys so again these cards are making moves we discussed the mega tim one getting cleaned out last time we have commons and commons and commons and rares don't sleep on these these could definitely bump up double up to 50 cents a pop who knows maybe four x billies 
on the line so you want to get your copies early if you want a holographic print the perfect mid max rarity is this four dollar ultra rare from dual devastator right here yeah look four dollars a lot of one ofs though yeah it's fours right now the massive ones are at fives i can see this being a ten dollar ultra rare i can't i can't see it doubling up especially as we get the new uh support the new decks the new core sets that are coming and things of that nature the demand is going to be there you want to make sure you get that exposure sooner rather than later we saw nibs he mained one side of two well, most people main three talked about this card <laughs> you know the gold rare is insane um but yeah just pick we talked about nib not too long ago so not going to go too much into detail same deal you can get nibs out of billy come on now billy nibs billy nibs let's get it man make sure you take advantage of that penny stock don't be that guy paying multiple billies down the line shifters over there at two in the ocg a lot of bandless speculation balance fears without uh, with regards to this one people think this card will get hit in the next bandless so you know the prices are suppressed not bad to get some exposure maybe at a place that you know i have my place set of, of platinum secrets as well um but that's about it you know f post balance if it doesn't get hit might be a good card to come and pick up back again and invest into um cheap secret rares at under billy's um card looks beautiful it has you know these prints now from the rarity collection so uh yeah just one to definitely keep on your radar link in the description down below guys make sure you swing by take advantage of 15 dollars off anything you give related or tcg you know cardboard related you can take 15 dollars credit off your purchase over here it can't get any better than that don't join in don't miss out a lot of people joining over there on the discord we continue to grow over 320 people join the movement don't miss out guys make sure you check out all of our other links over here and the friends of the channel these guys are amazing link in the description down below destroy that like and subscribe button ring that bell as we are on our journey to 4.5k then 5k join the movement don't miss out let's expand and let other people learn about this great community that's the thing if you feel great about the videos that we do just like the video it goes a long way and then destroy that like and subscribe button so that other people can also feel good about it just the value that we offer over on um here guys guys none of this content's official financial advice is for entertainment purposes only so here we have heat wave guys it's it's a it's a, um a card that is making noise um uh right now you know a lot of people the demand is going crazy but uh, even though you don't see this in, on this list right here um a lot of people believe that over here in the tcg people might actually play um whoa this card uh let's read it let's read it uh let's see let's see in inside tenpai dragon so here we have this card cannot can only be activated at the start of main phase one either player can normal special summon an effect monster until your next draw phase so i mean it's a card that it's good it's good i mean that's crazy you have a normal say it's on the mm, 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 mm. love it man heat wave look at that two dollars and fifty cents biking up into oblivion why because the card only has three prints only has three prints this one's bought out and then all other versions are nine to tens um for this card needs a re needs a reprint that's crazy even a speed dual common is at double digits insane this card was super cheap no one cared about it but that's the thing when a card becomes meta relevant or the potential or speculation um part is there then they, they spike up like this look at that Shh. The, the look at this chart man clear definition of parabolicness jay what is that is that even a word i don't know but it sounds right and it sounds good to my brain guys we have a trident draggy on we already talked about this card non-stop on the channel um before we knew that it was for tempai a dragon so again i mean 50 bills for the OTs. It's understandable. 32s. For the secrets. And what is... Man, that's crazy. This thing got cleaned up. Look at that. Zero percenters. That is crazy. The man is just mind-boggling. I'm going to have to, I might have to pay this premium man to play 10 pines, right? That's insane, man. That's just crazy. Literal definition of Mr. Clean coming in and cleaning out the markets five billies right there i mean five listings right there 37 wall of china at 34s that's insane that's crazy um second leg up status here we are then we have black winged dragon guys um i bought my cop i think i bought a secret rare just in case and uh, paid around like ten dollars i'm um, for my copy right there you have the ultras look beautiful from legendary collection 5ds you have uh supers you have commons 
bought four of these at 188 just to invest into these i believe these comments could push up towards fives we'll see um and just bought my secret rare i believe that was a perfect mid max rarity if you want to go more high end he's at around 60s that is not bad at all right here look at that. that's pretty cheap if you ask me card has been dumping down from the double a uh, triple digit range so this is a good buy i really thought about it honestly getting this one um it's a good buy right now in my humble opinion especially at these prices but again if you need any of these cheap cards you want to make sure that you get exposure to those now how about this one wait my bad guys this one too this one's making moves i thought i had it pulled up this one look at that 46 cents 50 cents just going parabolic i bought eight no 11 of these at billy's i bought 11 of these let me see is your boy here let me see is your boy here 11 right here this was me i bought 11 of these at a dollar um why because it was cheap i mean cheap compared to now it was way cheaper at around 30 40 cents before but it is what it is if we come late it's better to be early for the other people that are coming late -ter. i don't know if you understood what i wanted to say but that's the whole point we bought at billy's the chart hasn't updated yet um chart should be way up here guys so this the spike is real the demand is here 19 listings as you can see right there um we're discussing these and right there that's the one of guys so you want to make sure that you get exposure to these sooner rather than later already a lot of one of the next place is at twos man that's a quick hundo that's a quick double up in price in in, in the roi right there man look at that then you have six and then it continues on up so two pages only 19 listings i'm excited for this one um you know to continue it could be three billies maybe even fives you never know yes it does have another print um but the other one is an ultra rare first that og honestly the prismatic secret that's the max rarity here we go man it took forever what's going on right there look at that this one's cheaper but you got a lot of one ups the two ups right there but the four or more is already at a billy 50 as well so yeah if you can get this card on your hand sooner rather than later at least get one for some exposure i got 11 one for me 10 for the masses you guys know how we do over here black rose dragon obviously an iconic card for plant decks for edison and also right now for tenpai right here you got the one blast uh, a black rose right there that you want to make sure you get exposure honestly the one that i would be picking up is qcsr black rose dragon you know of course you do have um the other one where is it you have another ultra uh, you, this ultra looks clean man i have one of these um but where is it it's a dusa one right here dualist saga 50 cents to a billy that's it right there that's the one that i would be picking up if it's budget but you want a, a beautiful um if you're into dusa beautiful holographic version but if not this is it starting to spike from the lows already the demand is coming in as you can see let's just refresh to double check right here look at this card so you have a 15 wall at 415s after that the card quickly goes up to 475s and eventually five billies again qcsr 61 listings only comes as a promo in the tens very very hard to get right now um and the demand is going to start ramping up don't let this card be 750s and then double digits down the line right now five billies is that you know next stop conservative stop short term then 750s and maybe even as high as double digits so you want to get exposure to these i bought one recently just after i saw this just bought an extra one because i already have i think a place that um you know so i just wanted uh to be ready also moonlight moonlight as you guys can see uh, right here moonlight dragon where is it boom right here you have the one of right there you want to make sure you get access to this card it's two to three dollars for the ultras the supers are around two to two fifties as well so again you only need one you want to invest maybe ten dollars gets you a place that that is not bad at all to get access to this card um you know as we saw that it's it's used in the extra decks and the og the og for this version there's an ultra rare uh, promotional yes 15 dollars getting cleaned out bought out um look at that beautiful chart just parabolic only you have two here 25s and one at 50s gone oh, people want to play the max rarity um, but you do have these cheaper options they're going low in listings so if you need this card i wouldn't wait around you don't want to find yourself in a position where you're paying where you're paying five plus billies for a card that was two to threes then we have baron de fleur obviously came in the rarity collection you have many different prints to choose from even billy barons massive amount of listings that's good that's good you guys come in get your barons you know you can see it right here uh, right there <coughs> excuse me guys so right now cheap billy barons can't get any any easier or better than that for a billy or maybe even two i would play twos for these secret rares just clean mid-max rarity this is it right here 
Round two, Susan, some change. Card looks beautiful, man. I can't believe we have secret rare barons. Then we have Striker Dragon still at one here in the TCG, if I'm not mistaken. Five, six billion to the QCSR. That is not bad. Not bad at all, guys. You have multiple rarities. Yes, these are cheap. Um, you know, I would just get the rarity that you like and enjoy and you prefer. But if not, max rarity of this card is QCSR for five to six dollars. That is extremely cheap right now. It used to be sevens, retrace. Okay, to 650. This is it. It's gonna be double digits down the line. Five pages only, 45 listings. If you're playing this card, if you want this version, now is the time to get that exposure. And lastly, we have World Sea Dragon Zelantis. The OGs are fives pushing 750s. Wow, this is too cheap. This is too cheap. You have one of right here. Guys, this is too cheap right now. Yes, the card was quarter, went up to a Billy 20. That's 5X. Okay, we got it. But now retracing back down to the mean. If you can grab these at under Billy's, this is extremely cheap. Yeah, you do have the massive walls of China right here. <clears throat> Excuse me, with over 350 copies. But then after that, eventually this will be a Billy card and beyond. Under 100 listings, this is it. There's a chance to accumulate right now during this retracement. If you want exposure to a card that will most likely go up in price, you can see this at a Billy 50, a Billy 60, barely. I mean, minimal. That's a 2X, probably even higher. So you want to get exposure to a great card, a great penny stock like this one guys you guys already know man if you made it this far out into the video you guys are the straight mvps guys thank you so much for your time for your support and for your attention stay fresh